What's going on, everybody? Welcome back to another Arena Cube Draft. You know. That's your host. I'm the boast. I don't know if that... I think he's having a stroke. So now we're just going to draft powerful cards like Pelucranos Unchained. Yeah, that's a good one. I'm just going to slam that guy. Mirari's Wig seems cool, but I also... So is a really... But you have to have cards to make it work, so... I was in the middle of a sentence, but that's okay. Don't worry about it. I did the thing again. Yeah. Mike does this thing where he just interrupts his sentences. And I was saying, Mirari's wig is cool, but... And then he started saying his sentence. Wait, wig is in this format? In this arena? But I thought you were done. You said you I was, but not only did you interrupt me, you didn't even fucking hear what I was saying that you interrupted because you literally didn't even realize that Mirari's Wake was in the cube, which is the specific card I was talking about. <laughs> oh, God. It's just painful sometimes. That's all. You like Veerhop over Trophy? No, you hate Trophy. You despise Trophy. Yeah, I'd rather have a 5 4 that gains me life. And family. It's hard to block. Anyway, as I was saying, Mirari's Wake is pretty sweet, but I don't know how many payoffs there are in this cube. I know there's an Ulamog, but I think that's probably the only really big 10-ish mana card. What set was it in? What set was what in? Wake. I mean, since it's on here, it was probably in Jumpstart. Oh. Yep. Well, no. Not yep. <laughs> That's not the jumpstart symbol. Oh, I thought you were searching the set jumpstart. No. I actually have no idea what set it's in on here. They just put it in? It's like only in commander sets. Why is it on here? Go away. Shut up and take my money. Okay. Oh, Mucho. Hey, Frank, I'm going to let you finish, but Murari had the best card of all time. <laughs> Oh, God. It's true. Raskin? It's either Command of the Dreadhorde's also pretty good. So is Scoot Swarm and Primal Might. But I'll take the Vraska. Just murder everything. That's the solution. Just murder all their permanents. I murdered your daddy. How dare you. Oh, Oracle? Oh, yeah, we're taking Oracle and we'll die for sure. Um, yeah, I agree. If Find Finality or Lotus Cover come back, that would be cool, but... I ain't expecting it. It'd be a lot cooler if it did. <laughs> Alright, we're two colors. We're drafting all powerful spells so far. Me likey. Probably added to a remaster set like Thoughtseize. Historic Anthology. Oh, there you go. There you go. Hey, man. What, man? Do you like it when I get those ultras... COQ 100s? Whatever that is. What does that mean? Someone's got super creatine. I know what creatine is. Super creatine! Well, what's an EAA Aminos? I'm gonna take Gold Goose. He's on the loose. I didn't get to see the pack, but I'll agree. Is that like a goose boy? He's almost as good as birds. What's he saying? So goose is almost as good as a No, no, I was asking chat to translate because I think that's the only way we'll understand each other, Michael. I think that was pretty clear for once. <laughs> yeah, I don't think so, <laughs> buddy. Say anything crazy. My hand hurty. Oh, your hand hurty? Yeah. Oh, what? Well, Blooming Marsh. Worth considering. No, I'm going to take Rishkar. Man, you hate those lands. If I'm playing a two color deck, I'm not super concerned with like one of the fast lands that's. But gotta go fast. I'd much rather have a turn two Rishkar that can actually ramp us into these other things. That could help with it. How could that? How could that help with it? Because it, it could be you could tap for a goose, and then you'd have turn two Rishkar. I wouldn't have the Rishkar. I took. I would have taken the Blooming Mart. Dang, right. But if it circled around. I'll I'll just I'll just hope the Blooming Marsh, which is a very unpopular land, tables around instead. You still won't take it. You hate it. I hate you. Yeah. Did you know that? Oh, Elvish Visionary. Oh, that's, that's the new line of war. That's a, 
Look at that. Look at that 3D motion. Oh my god, it's, that's nuts. It's actually really satisfying actually to watch. Cool. <laughs> uh, token maker. Maybe we take this blood for bones. Have you signed up for the government's blood for bones program, Michael? Oh, so you get a guy back and a guy in hand. That's pretty good. Well, you gotta sacrifice something, but yeah, being able that, to like get back fine. Gear Hulk is pretty yeah, sweet. That's good. Also, because it's part of the cost. Well, Make no, it... you don't target. So actually, you can get the guy you sacrifice back. Oh, you can wait. What? Yeah, return a creature oh, and yeah, return another they, creature. Yeah, it doesn't they target sack at all. First. Yeah, yeah. Oh, do I just want cruel reality? Oh Jesus, that's a, that's a lot of damage. Oh yeah, we're taking that thing. Oh yeah, big take. Michael, you never answered me about the Blood for Bones program. Uh, it seems dangerous. I think I'll pass. <laughs> you get blood for your bones, though. What do I need blood for? <laughs> what do you need bones for, bro? To live. I don't know. You sound like... Oh, no, that guy's better. Never mind. Yeah, I'm taking this regrowth. Well, Bastion's... I'll take it, the regrowth. Bastion's Robogaboo is good. That's not a real thing that you just said. You just made up a card. The Black Enchantment's good. You know the one. No. The Eureka's Castle. Putting down ideas for your cube? Yeah, bish. Nice. This is where my UPS package is right now. You send me a update list of the cards you still need? No. Okay, fine. I guess I'll give them to you for free. Do you get another box? Yeah. That's where I got the jewel letters. I'm not 100% sure what you still need, so. If you liked foils, I'd have plenty for you, but they bendy. Although the etch foils don't bend, so I don't know why they don't just make all foils that style now. They don't actually bend. What are you talking about right now? Etch foils do not bend. There's oh hey, Dreadhorde came back. Dreadhorde came back. You can come in on me. Village rights. Yeah, that's good. It only costs one. Man, what Damn a bang it. Nothing here. Eh. Not that weirdo, dude. <laughs> Look at the art. Yeah, it's a bunch of weirdos in it. Not bad. Eh. Don't cast that. You won't be able to do stuff. Ooh, Silvala. Ooh, Tangle Florahedron. And that Awakening card's good. And Atlanta War Elf. Oh, man, there's, there's a lot of options for us here, actually. Awakening card? Oh, Agademes? Yeah, that's a banger. I think it's Land of World. What about Savala? That card's pretty nutty. It's fine. It does trigger for your opponent, too. I want a Land of World, Michael. <laughs> Don't try to stop me. It's a Clias. Oh, oh great hinge. I love yeah, a Great Hinge. And there's, like, nothing else in this pack, even. Yeah. Even if you can't cast it super early, it's still pretty broken. If you read it out loud, Michael, it makes more sense. I don't, I don't get it. Do you get it? No, I don't actually. She had one baby? Is that the joke? I don't Hmm. <laughs> you know, the good henge just doesn't compare to the great henge. I wonder what the good henge would do. Is composed as compared to the Great Hinge. Mike, how was the game? It was good. He lost, so. I yeah, man, I definitely didn't win. He's not very good. I didn't make eighteen treasures or something like that. Okay, wow. Okay, humble brags. It was so good that was while I was exiling stuff off my opponent's libraries. I didn't want to cast them because they're like, eh, my cards are just better. Is barbecue chicken better with rice or mashed potatoes? 100% mashed potatoes. I do not consider rice a barbecue chicken side. It's a tough call for me, but I think mashed potatoes takes it. That's a tough call. I mean, I know you like rice, but you have to acknowledge that that's not a barbecue side. When have you ever gotten barbecue with rice? What if it's like wild rice and it's like a... 
a Jamaican barbecue place. That's not barbecue. Like you're just That's changing different. what it is. Like, you're talking about American barbecue, sure, yeah. It's like <laughs> Oh, um Surge maybe? Surge is good. Surge? Yeah. I'm Auto taking Heartless Actor Rex Sage, Michael. Do you I'm know taking what Surge cards. Does? Yeah, it just doubles you. The effect finds two lands. Big fucking deal. I got Oracle, Michael. I got Rishkar. I got Emissary. I got Land of War Elves, Gilded Goose. Oh, wait, Field of the Dead is also a banger. Am I going to search for a Field of the Dead yet? How are we going to have seven different land types? Oh, yeah. We have literal just forests and swamps right That's now. That's good, yeah. Good point. Yeah. <laughs> I forgot about that part. So, okay. Seems relevant. I don't know. I play Commander. None of my lands are the same. God, Pharaoh's Gift is interesting. It's a good one. Incubation Druid's good. I like a Druid boy. Bestiary's not bad either, but I think Druid's better. <sighs> My secret layers are on the way. Which ones? Walking Dead. That's a good one. It's the only one I ever bought. It's cool then on those. Estimated delivery time between 11 and 3 p.m. Well, it's 3.06 right now, so... It's not I looking think, good I for think you. Blue seal might be good enough for cube. I don't want to put any of them in the cube though, because they're all foil, and I wish they had a oh, non-foil version. Yeah. I would definitely add those to the cube if they were non-foil. Blue seal is definitely good enough for cube. I do wonder if it's well, a, if blue seal is good enough for cube, then I would just put Negan in. Because blue seal's like if they deal, if you take damage at the sack of dude, and you make a two-two zombie, right? I think. Equipped creature gets plus two, oh, plus two, plus zero, and menace. Whenever it deals attacks, defending player sacks a creature if they do your credit oh, walker. Better. Yeah, yeah, that's really good. That's only two and four to equip. Not bad. It's like, Wait, if it's an etch foil, maybe it's worth it. It's an etched foil. So if it's an etch foil, it means it doesn't bend. The new kind of foils they have, like from the Commander Legends, they literally don't bend. Really? Yes. I'll show you. I have several. They, they just literally have not bent at all. What? I'll show you. Is this true, chat? Yeah. This is wild. I've never heard I of such a thing. Right now? I don't want to do that, but I'll show you later. Because maybe I'll just put Negan in, because that would be cool, right? Negan yeah, if searches if for the seal, doesn't he? actual etch, then you're good. What does that guy do? That guy. <laughs> when Negan enters the battlefield, you and target opponent each secretly choose a creature that player controls. Then those choices are revealed, and that player sacrifices those creatures. Uh, I thought he searched for Lucille for some reason. That would make sense, but maybe. I guess that's not. Maybe, maybe I just made that up. Uh, I'm going to take Golos here. Yeah. Even if you can't activate him, just like... A five mana three five that gets you lands pretty good. Oh, I'll activate him. Don't you worry. Also, we get any special lands. Also, whenever opponent sacrifices a creature, you create a treasure token. Man, I could have sworn Negan made the. I feel dumb for not. Thank you. So wait, so when he comes into play, you just kill two dudes. Hold on. Unless he chooses the same one. Jundasaur, thank you for the reset, buddy. Welcome back. Really appreciate it, my dude. I'll take Knight of Autumn in case we want to splash a white. So when he enters the battlefield, you and an opponent each secretly choose a creature that player controls. Okay, so you choose. Okay, so the downside is if you pick the same thing, it's only going to get one. Yeah, so you kind of want to. It's it's definitely a game where you're like, I'm going to pick like, your second worst my, creature. Ooh. That's kind of cool. Now hmm. we take field. Nah, still probably not going to be able to trigger it, right? Hmm. It still might be worth it. Yeah, like maybe we just take out Fine all the enough. lands. Ooh, our one guy counts as a, as a different. Oh, land. God for his gift came back. That's awesome. Our yeah, one guy counts our, as a different. Like land guy, the flippy guy. I think it's a land, but also a creature or whatever. Or no, the uh, the one that gets back at thing. The regrowth, but it's also land. He's hitting the sauce, guys. <laughs> I really like the um. Those ones, the visions, those are cool. Oh, Drown Catacomb? That's actually, actually a the one that looks like sweet one to just bit. play. There's Warm Boy. I think it might just be Fiend Artisan in here. I mean, if this is a, if this is a cooler Triome, I would definitely consider it. it. It was like the Salt Eye one. I also don't hate Skittering Surveyor. Just comes into play, finds the land. Worm Boy might come back too. Also, I mean, like, I'm not really worried about Mask Arm. We have literally two yeah. six drops, two seven drops, and a nine drop, so I'm not really looking for another six drop here. I'm yeah, just going to take Skinny Surveyor. We have a lot of ramp, though. But yeah, getting the lands is important. 
So the Dryad only changes, it, it changes their subtype. It doesn't change their name. If you have Field of the Dead, it doesn't actually uh, increase their, their names. You don't no, control like different lands of different types. It does work with Valakut, though, which is kind of cool. Isn't that, isn't that cute? Isn't that valid cute? I'm going to take this Elder Gargaroth. I'm going to make a lands deck for command. If Hydra or Eldest Reborn or Sun Pillar Grove come back, I'd be alright with that. Oh, this is the first time I've seen Ronus in this cube. Oh yeah, big Ronus. You could take um, Blast Zone. As a oh, to act, just to activate Golos? Yeah, that actually does seem pretty decent. You can take Blast Zone since you can search with Golos and it'll trigger field, potentially. It's also pretty good. I don't, I don't love it, but... What else are we going to take in this pack? Like Blood Artist, I guess? Your dad, Michael. We're going to take your daddy. Oh, and Dotha Triumph seems great here. Is it just better than... Which color is that one? It's the uh, it's Junk. Abzan. Abzan. Is it better than J Jade Light Ranger though? Jade Light Ranger is just really good, and uh, I feel like this is just too cute. How deep you want to go with the Field of the Dead? I don't think I want to go deeper than having a Jade Light Ranger. What's that mic? Maybe not though. It's just Trilan. I love that card. Inscription's real good. That seems pretty good. Yeah, it's just a little more versatile. Glad we took the Heartless Act. So this is 28 cards with three lands, so it's like 25 cards. <coughs> 14 creatures. Oh, wait. No, I think he means because Dryad makes them all land types, we can activate Golos' second. He did. I already said oh, that. Oh, okay. <laughs> yeah. Michael's like the, Michael has the chat delay in real life. Sorry, man. Chat's delayed. I mean, I literally have, like, probably 60 of the etch foils from all the commander boxes, and none of them have bent. The regular foils have, but the reg the etch don't bend at all. Could be Chapel. Eh, I think it's actually Chapel. Oh. oh. Survive trial oh. seems good. Oh. Okay. You still got a pack to go, right? No, this is pack three. Yeah, that seems... What do we got here? One, two, three, four, five. Seven with Forest and the other one. All right, that looks good. Also, making food tokens with Goose only to be able to sack them with... Uh, Varaska seems pretty sweet. Oh, that is sweet. Ooh, castle, oh, castle lock, lock do I? Oh, this is no. This has got to be better, right? Well, we don't have any actual white spells, right? I guess. But I mean, it would help activate goals potentially. Right. That's what I'm more worried. That's what I'm more okay, interested sure. in. And yeah. it's a it's a black source that that also helps with field and goals. Yeah. Gotcha. Nope. You don't do it. Oh, we could take Crocs now. We have red sources, right? We have a red source. Well, let's see if you can't goals. Plus you have uh, some turn eight. We're gonna play Crocs well, and never have, be able to get them plus back. Plus you have um, what's it called? The the, the dryad or whatever. Or did you not take that? There was no dryad. He's oh. he, would, he would like talking about if we ever got it. Oh, then it's not Crocs. Then. Yes, it, I I don't think it was Crocs at any point. I don't know what it took actually. Oh, shade. All right, that's kind of what I wanted. Mm, Grove. Not bad. Hmm. Incinerator. ALS have field. Destroy non-basic SB, right? What does that sentence mean at all? Oh, yeah, we do have field of ruin. Oh, wow. That was actually... That's pretty good. Hey. All right. Okay. What that one do? Don't matter. No, oh, that's yeah, it's a lot of work. Caruga, Jamaica. Ooh, I wanna take a We got fifteen creatures yet? We do. I like it. Tell your mommy I said hi. Again, not my mom. 
It's always his mommy. He's just ashamed. Michael, don't be ashamed of your own mommy, okay? Just because you saved the salami for her. Alright, so it's nice because this this is a black land. This is a, a green land. Uh, this is a green land. This is a black land. Black land. Like, all of our lands are our two base colors, which is super nice. And most of them will come into play untapped if we have um, a swamp or a forest. So, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. We have 11 different land types, which is pretty sweet. <sighs> Command the Dread Horde. We can probably take that out for now. I think we have enough to top end. We need one more card. Is command better than um, the enchantment, though? For really Alley? I don't know. Depends on what they have in their graveyard, really. Yeah. <laughs> Golden Goose, appreciate the translation. Um. Actually, we could play the Knight of Autumn, too. We definitely have enough white sources. We have one, two, three, four... Four white sources plus gilded goose plus incubation. Well, incubation drew is not going to get white source. Um, let's take out shade. How many lands we got now? Plus, this is also another land type. How many lands? Yeah, we have 18. Eight, 17 lands. Plus the flippy guy. So, yeah, yeah, that seems good. I like it. Three, that looks sweet. Four, five, six, seven, and then five. Six, seven. Hmm. Turn out seven, seven. I don't love it. Well, seven, seven plus Fluffy guy. Three. Thank you. God, it's so hard to move things on here. Like, holy shit. Yeah, those are black sources. Then we have five, six, seven green sources. Golden Goose, welcome back. Thank you for the resub, buddy. Hate if you count Balagad recovery. Which Just is still kind of low, especially like land oils and goose. Probably want another green. We could probably cut blast though. Meh. I think this is probably fine. I mean, like, the problem is we have five sources of green that come into play untapped. Six six that come into play untapped on turn one. Yeah, I would definitely try to fit in one more. I mean... I think we cut Blast Zone, right? I, I'm trying to not reduce the number of lands we have for Field of the Dead. Because right now we have 11 different types? Yes. And going down to 10 seems... Worse, yeah. Like, not even worth it. I'm gonna play it like this. I believe Thank in this. Thank you. Oh, Salazar! Thank you so much for the resub, buddy. Welcome back. You deleted a non-basic. No, we wouldn't be able to submit if we did that. Seems like a banger. Hmm. A little slow, but so am I. Got him. I got myself. Self Gotti. Yeah. I wrecked him. Little He's... bitch. <laughs> he is a little bitch. He's got a tap lane in turn one. Some guys have all the luck. And this gets to play come and play untapped because of the fort, because of the planes. Because it's a planes. Oh yeah, that's where we're casting right now. No, it's not as good when you have things in the yard, but You don't know me. I don't care about your fabloop. Hmm. Okie dokie. Now we can murder his full blue for six mana. <laughs> God, if they counter my Oracle, I'm going to be so sad. Okay, that's fine. Wow, we drew literally both of our... Oh, yeah. Oh, oh yeah. We drew both of our seven drops and one of I our six drops. That Explorer boy? So we can, like, manipulate the top of our library again? Tell me about your Explorer boy, Michael. What do you want to Everything. Everything. Cool. Well. Yeah. I guess we can still Golos and play Balagid Recovery as our land. That's actually really good. 
Actually, if we do that, Golos will trigger... We can go at Field of the Dead? Oh, yeah, we'll get us 2 2. Oh, yeah, that's pretty good. It's all coming together. We don't have a second Black Source, though. But you know what? We need more Black Sources when you can just murder your opponent. Oh, yeah. It's all coming together. I kind of play Tap, which is a little sad, but. I mean, we can only block this guy anyway, so it doesn't matter. Oh, that's good. Getting T2s off all your lands is so. Really looking for a black source. Mm. Oh, we don't. Yeah, we move. Yeah. Are you saying something right now? I don't think we have the colors for gold. Yeah. Oh! Oh. One, two, three, four. That's pretty good, actually. Dang it. Oh, yeah. Big murder. No, we don't have We don't have anything in the yard, though, right? No. Okay, don't do that. Well, I could get this guy. I could sack this guy and get him back, so. Oh, that's sick. I don't think it does anything. Oh, we could also we could also feel the ruin something. One two is it two to activate? One two activate, and we would have. We won't get a guy though, right? No, we don't have any swamps. So we will get a guy. I don't know what he's saying right now. Because you get to search out a land. It doesn't matter if you. It doesn't matter if the land coming into play is already on board. As long as you have seven when a land comes into play, you get a guy. Oh. So we, we had, well, we started with seven. We go one, two, three. We'd have one, two. Oh, we didn't have any lands in hand, though, so yeah, it wouldn't have worked. So next time we're just going to hope Noxious Gear Hulk resolves, I guess. Where are the boys? I haven't heard from the boys in a while. They're probably sleeping. You'd hope so. We'd know if they make any damage. Guess we're taking seven here. I'm pretty sure we're dead. What the fuck was that? Don't know. You got it. Cult of personality. We got three, can't do anything. God, we're one mana shy of being able to, like, blood for bones as well. Yep. Fucking of course. Cool. Well, I guess the game's over. Must be nice. Cool. Oh, boy.
All right, well, this is an exciting hand of nothing so far. Yep. Three drop. Four drop. Cool. <laughs> Seems good. Oh, yeah, big grumbles. Yep. Here we go. He gets pass. Yep. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, big pass. I guess we can play Rush Car. Look in my eyes, it's Michael B. Did just me or his chat kind of slow them on? I don't know. Yes, it definitely is. Just enough mana to keep up with that sky or cool? Sweet Gargarino. Are you going to bounce it? Yeah, of course you are. Which is actually fine, because now yeah, that guy fine. doesn't, like, it's not, that doesn't seem like a huge deal. That's okay, they're just going to have to seal away. Ready? Are you ready? Michael, are you ready? Cast out. Oh, wow, or Lava Glide. That's fascinating. I'm sure it's dead. Eat these dead. And I wish Garlic off the trigger when you the battlefield. Sure. I mean, at least they got rid of their guys. We can get our guy back. No, I'm just gonna play Cruel Reality. Seems good, actually, yeah. That's quite a clock. Cult of personality. Got three turns, you little bitch. One, two, three, four, five, six. They're just probably just gonna play a realm cloak giant as a seven seven. It's gonna be a dead seven seven. I guess in their upkeep they can play. Brazen B. Oh, they didn't do anything. I guess they're gonna play the brazen B. We can get our boy back. That scheme's good, right? That scheme's good. Get our boy back playing. Do we have enough mana for that? I think we do, right? Wow, they're going to use two green for that? That's pretty hilarious, actually. Classic. <laughs> Gotta do a manual, because they don't know. One, two, three. Uh, return a card from my graveyard. Put it into my noodly hand. Oh, you can go for red there? Why would I go for red? Because Gol Golos? Yeah. Who even has that card? We, we do. Who even knows what a Golos is, Michael? Okay, they had it. Look at that. Look at him go. It's all coming together. That's fine. They're taking another five? Sure. Clock's ticking, boy. The clock is ticking, boy. We can just play a Henji. We definitely cannot do that. Yep. This restricts them a lot, though. Yeah, it really does. They also tapped all their blue. Wait, oh, they had to. Yeah, yeah, okay. Taking five is not good. All right, we can play Henge. Ho, ho, ho. That's a banger. You got no blue man, you stupid nerd. One, two, three, four, five. I 
to sacrifice. I really don't think they have another flash creature. That seems really unlikely. I was clearly mistaken. <sighs> okay, that's got to be the last one, right? <laughs> We're just going to lose this <laughs> angel. No, I'll just kill it next turn with Hydra. Is that one, two, three, four, five, six? That's a zombo. Oh, I didn't know it triggered on itself entering. Jeez. You don't know anything. He knows nothing about the world. Cause he was born in a trash I just can. don't feel like wasting this right now. Like it just doesn't seem like it's- Yeah, but like we die if they don't have- it. No we don't. This We gain two life from oh, this. Oh yeah. It all worked out. What if you had two flash creatures? Well. Feels like he's really fighting an uphill battle here. Well, we got a voracious Hydra now. <laughs> They're like, your live delivery is no longer available. You can no longer look at this package. You don't get your oh, stuff now it's anymore. Back. Uh, it's my point really likes flashing. Yeah. This guy has to be a four. Was this one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine? Well, let me get him as big as possible there. No, no, because I draw something. I want to be able to see what I draw here. <laughs> I mean, I guess. Uh, but like, sure. It's a man. Right, but. We don't really have much going on, so... Wow, that was really good. Yeah. Glad they added that card. No, I'm not. Maybe you won't pay. Maybe. Oh, they paid. Dang it. Ooh, me likey. So uh, one goes in play, one goes in hand, right? Return a creature card to the battlefield. Yeah, that seems good. That seems very good. Alright, let's try again. Oh, yeah. The murder the murder stick is better. Okay. Got him. Jesus. What a friggin' uphill battle, man. Actually, I think he was just dead there, because we kill his angel. That's gonna go on the upkeep. We kill him five. He goes to five, right? He's just dead if he doesn't have a flash creature. Michael, send me an angel. Okay. Have you played the Supreme Vintage yet? Yes, uh, a while ago during PAX. Man, this deck is sick. This is like my favorite kind of deck. You just like grind it out and play lands and they just die. It's and then they just die. It's my favorite kind of deck. It's my next commander deck. It's going to be a teamer lands deck. I would love to see like having an extra much a heartless act in this matchup, but we have not yet. We won though, so it's cool. <laughs> well, we still got one more game, so... Push it to the limit. Hey, look, we saw the Heartless Act. And a Pelucranos? Yeah, this hand seems good. Walking on the razor's edge. Oh, wow. Both of the cards I wanted to see. Oh yeah, look at this. I get to look at your hand. Sphinx's Rev is great. Realm Cloak Giant is good. Overwhelming Splendor is... That's cute, but I mean, like, I don't really know if I care about it. Uh, I mean, that's pretty annoying. It's eight mana. Yeah, true. So do you have outs? I think it's Giant. Like, they don't really it's have... A, they don't have a great answer for Polychronos here, if we take their Giant. Sphinx's Rev is slow, so... Just like me. Have you played Supreme Vintage yet? No. Yes, I just said yes. Come on, Dillon Mace. Get it together. I hope they draw like a shit bird here. And not a counterspell. Interesting. We must have something red. 
Hope you didn't draw Essence Scatter in the two cards you drew. Nice. So we know these three don't deal with it. This one has escape, right? Yeah. And a bunch of others with like a million abilities, basically. Ooh, you coming to play tapped? I mean, that's fine, I guess. Not even worth it. Oh, and we can blood for bones with escape value. That's kind of cute. What does that what do you mean? Uh, well, we can sack blue grenades too. Oh, Sphinx for two? Good deal. If you want to draw two cards for five mana, it's fine. Now that he's getting closer to eight mana. Oh, we can just Heartless Act it though, right? It's an enchantment. I don't know what you're talking about. His stupid enchantment that makes all guys long. You cannot Heartless Act that, no. Heartless Act destroys a creature. Oh, I'm thinking of the other card. I have no idea what you're thinking think about. You sound like a maniac. Kills an enchantment. You could feel his red source here. Yeah. They haven't really shown us any red things that we care yeah. about. One, two, three, four. Plus, it also puts some more mana behind. I mean, I really just hope they do something next turn because then we get to uh, play Cruel Reality. And that should be good. feed the swarm. Is that what Mike's thinking of? Yes. I think that's the name. Fight, gain life, put two counters. Yeah, I guess that's fine. We're just playing the Hugo's first game. Yeah, I mean, we didn't see a ton of non-Essence Scatter counter spells. Of course they have it, though. Why wouldn't they? That's alright. Okay. No, please use, please use this. And this. And these two. Jesus. Oh, let's have all your color sources, <laughs> dude. <laughs> Why, though? Wow, really? You're gonna fucking gear hulk here? <sighs> God. Must be it's nice. It's fun in the third game when they show us infinite more counter spells they didn't have before. It's always fun. It's a fun surprise. We do have Blood for Bones. Like, next time we can play Orzhov Enforcer, Blood for Bones, get back this guy, and... Oh, good. That seems... That seems very good. I don't remember exactly what the card is, but I know it's good. Hey man, now if they make it a one one, it'll still be a Christ, dude. Oh god. <laughs> Got death touch? Oh, but getting this back actually does nothing. Which is kind of unfortunate. Also it don't fly, right? What is that doesn't matter when you fight. Oh. Magic doesn't care about fighting creatures, Michael. I mean, it would just get rid of it, though, right? Yes, but what does that matter? I don't, I don't care yeah, about it. has got afterlife too, right? So one comes into play. Yep. Wow. I thought, we were, I thought we had a really good opening and we were doing really well. Every time I don't draft uh, Reclamation Sage, I fucking hate myself for it. Every single time I get punished. Oh good, they're gonna copy their guy. Great. I, mean, I don't really... whatever. It feels like the match we lost was kind of like if they just happen to have a counter spell in the LED. Yep. Is 
guess I have like fucking what nine cards or some shit, seven cards, million cards. Oh gee, I wonder if they have another coach though. Three, four, five. Really, you're gonna play your, your yep? Don't do that again. Yeah, it's gonna be packed navigation, 100%. They're just trying to figure out if it's worth it. Mike has a double voice? Well, I don't know why Mike's... Why his mic would pick it up and my mic doesn't pick up... His mic doesn't pick up my voice. And it was leaning over towards you at the time or something. Hello? I'm pretty sure you definitely oh. want it closer. <laughs> this is okay. not a... Uh, that's good. You know, we got time, I guess, but we have so many freaking cards. They don't have that much time. They have patient rebuilding. Oh, yeah. Well, none of these things result will matter that much right now, so they're going to let them resolve. Last zone to five. It's gonna be a long time. Yeah, I mean it's just not a reasonable option right now. Okay, well, you get it, man. You got three, four angels. <sighs> Last zone kills their angels and rebuilding. Oh yeah, killing rebuilding is pretty good. Right, but it doesn't. I mean, yeah, it's probably our only option, right? How nice. Oh boy. This key went from being great in the first eight drafts to really shit in the ninth and tenth draft. The problem is we could do it next turn, but then we'd have to give them a whole other turn before we even do it. And they still had like nine cards. <laughs> I mean, we might have been able to play it out, but like it's it's a real uphill battle. I didn't know that came into play tapped. I guess that's fine. We still have land where elves. Yeah, I mean, tapping for a different color is probably not going to be relevant here. Draw 
on Golos. That'd be sweet. <laughs> oh, I, I like Golos. Me too, man. He's real cool. Finale Devastation, huh? That's a good one. No blocks. One, two, three. Target creature counters. Oh, well, that's good. Target now we can tap for Target creature control. Oh, yeah. Give me the juice. Five, six, seven, eight. I mean, it's, it's not great either when we're gonna Hydra that little biscuit. That little biscuit's gonna be Hydra. But can he like prevent damage from itself or something? No. You can't just make up abilities, Michael, and think they. Well, I thought it had something to do with they remove counters. Or... Yeah, it does. When it prevents damage and removes counters instead. Okay. Are you coming in to play untapped? No, you are not. So... Yeah, I probably want to swap. But next turn, huh? Oh, he did. If we could draw no more lands, that'd be sweet. I would like that. I told you it was land. Oh, yeah. Give me that value. Give me that sweet, sweet value. Three, four, five, six. Yeah. I mean, yeah. Oh, we're just getting a chumper, you know? Chumper, I gotta get you any land. Interesting. And he doesn't have any cool land. Here. And he's got trample, so I don't even know. That guy's trample, too. Jeez. This guy? Man, that guy's good. Yeah, it's real good. That's a banger. That's why I put that dude in the cube. What are you doing, little man? Should probably put that in my green deck. Should probably put up your bee hole. The my up the fit. put it up the Michael bee hole. Oh, that doesn't kill anything I care about. Actually, so. yeah, kill our atlas. I guess if you want. Our, our atlas? Yeah. Oh, the surveyor, different card. <laughs> Wait, what did you think it was? I was thinking of the atlas card that puts a land in play. Walking atlas? Yeah. <laughs> That's not the same at all, Michael. Oh man, yeah, give me that trick. Oh yeah, they're dead. Infinite dead. Yeah, murder their 2 3. Or their 3 3, just get in for infinite. Only a fool stands in my way. Yeah, I don't actually care about Slavala that much. No. It's not often I'm outmaneuvered. What's this guy? Six, right? Yeah. Do they concede? They, yeah. They oh, I think we just got a one. Maybe I don't even know. I don't even do math a lot. I'm not smart. I think I'm a significantly better Magic player when I'm on MT. I'm on MTGO rather than MTG Arena. Oh, we had enough to just leave them. Yeah. Gotcha. I'm just gonna submit. Say I told you we had lethal, Michael. <laughs> Jimmy confirmed it. Thank you, Jimmy. Jimmy. I think Arena Cube is pretty decent. I think this cube has been great. That being said, gotta run a bad luck, but that's just that's just Frank. Wow. <laughs> God damn. Well, you know it's true. Michael had a family. M -m -m Michael and the bee. Oh, the shirt. You can take thanks Superfits for this one. Ooh, that's a little rough. Mm. This hand's perfect. Wow. It's the best hand I could ask for. 
I mean, if maybe one of those is Field of the Dead, I'd agree a little more. But if it was one of Field of the Dead, I'd be pretty more bad bad to be dead. I guess going to six is kind of... Michael, you ever mulligan before? It's, it's terrible. Worst. I would have saved it for cycle. Okay, no, I know. Nothing. Nothing. Oh, 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 oh. oh look, if it isn't Super Fritz himself, right on time. More like Super Shits, am I right? Oh, wow. He has a family friend. <laughs> Does he? Oh, wow. This keeps getting ruder and ruder. God, Man, Inner Chapel doesn't come into play tapped. Nice. Oh, yeah, when they attack with that. It's always good. We're gonna put a counter on here. And when you attack with your natural selection. My god, I mean I'm wearing the shirt with all the children on it. <laughs> I don't know. I don't wanna get arrested or something. <laughs> These are my cheddar cheese children. Whatever, sir, get in the back. <laughs> Alright, buddy, let's go back to the home. To the home. Well, biscuits and gravy. Biscuits yeah, and that gravy. seems pretty good right now. Biscuits and gravy? <laughs> yes, but also just to take his bomb that he's about to play. What are you saying? What are you saying? His last, he's probably got one bomb in hand we can just take it. And then the game's over. Oh, I was, I, what? They have three cards in hand. One was going to be, they're going to have one bomb. I mean, I'm just playing Oracle. Okay. And... Instead of playing Oracle, you want me to just not play Oracle? I mean, any creature, they turn into a different creature, so I'm not really oh, that's super a good concerned yeah. with, like... Also, they haven't used it yet, so maybe they have just nothing. Plus, we got this Voracious Hydra on the top, so... But they know about it. What does that matter? That means they won't cast their bomb, and then you'll feel stupid. Yeah, I'll feel real dumb when they're not winning because they didn't cast their cards. Exactly. exactly. See, now you're getting it. I really it's understand. All together. What? I've never seen someone actually have this in their deck. It's uh, only good in aggro decks, and he's really not, not really pushing it. I'm not really seeing the... Uh, the aggradation. I mean, I guess we're at 16, but... Yeah, in eight turns, we're dead. I mean, if you want to attack with both your guys and do nothing else, by all means. I mean, Elder Gargroth is pretty good at not caring about that. Oh, boy, they did. They got a goose coming up? Okay. Goose is on the horizon. Hey man, that goose can be whatever he wants, to be fair. Man, playing two lines a turn. Seek. It is a sickness. That only gets... Does that get anything, or...? It's anything we want, man. Oh, man. It's gonna use both your black swords? Nice. <laughs> <laughs> no, I got another black source over here. Still, though, like, why wouldn't you just use the swamp and the... Colorless. Oh, got a ram through and an Agadim's Awakening. I don't care about the Awakening. I'll take the ram through. So basically, you're drawing Goose and you have no answer for our big boy. They're gonna go land, land. I mean, they can get whatever they want. I might right? kill Fauna Shaman next turn, yeah. Actually, they can get a six drop here, which is pretty good. Did they, did they just cast the goose? They just... Do they not know Fauna Shaman is literally natural selection or whatever that stupid card is? Survival of the fittest. Yes. Like, why would you... What do you need a goose for? You're 18. You don't need the life, man. They wanted. To, they didn't want to shuffle their Elvish Reclaimer. Their one man. drop. Yeah, man. They could go get... A non-basic land. That was definitely terrible. It's your boy. It's your murder boy. You like drawing cards? I like drawing cards. Oh, I'm going to draw a card for sure. Oh, yeah, we're doing that for true. I mostly just want lands to be underneath it. Damn it, Goose. <laughs> Damn it, Goosey. Hey, can't you just do that and murder their whole team? What, this? Yeah. It fights one thing. So you fight their... I guess we don't have to fight Shaman because they don't know it has a second ability. I mean, I'm definitely killing it because I feel like we got Just lucky. In case, yeah. It's murder. Shaban. Most people in the queue don't have cards. You well, if you play a card, you read with abilities. It's right on the card. Yeah, man. yeah. I mean, it's not like they're hiding it from you. You just have to guess, and some they're just guessing incorrectly. You selected it. You put it in your deck, and you played it. 
Okay, I wonder how different this game would be because they had to have other creatures in hand to use, right? Oh yeah, get back your Fauna Shaman. Let's see if you remember to use it this time. Nope, you played your one drop. You played your you got back a Fauna Shaman and played your one drop. I don't understand what's happening. This right is now. absolutely amazing. I mean, I'm not saying they should have won or anything, but like, <laughs> this could have been an actual game. Oh, yeah, make a food. That's good. Oh yeah, deal this one. You got it, buddy. But it was not good. Damn it! Where my lands at? Here comes Santa Claus. Here. That ain't Santa Claus. Damn it. It's like a murder clause. So wait, how much money do you have? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, seven. Oh man, you can't quite murder everything, but you can murder most of their stuff. There are three? Do we wait or just win? One, two, three, four. So we can just play this guy and shoot the shaman again. I shot the shaman. But I did not shoot the Michael B. Oh, thank God. I don't want to get shot. <laughs> yeah, man, you got it. Okay. Good game. That'll be, that'll be the end. Did we have lethal? Probably. Who cares? They played their golden goose when they had a fauna shaman in board, so. Yeah, in board, not on board. I don't know what he's saying right now. It was in the board. Oh, Brett with the bits? Oh no, spilled all my bit. God damn it. I hate it when that happens. Oh yeah, I love a good cotton candy. How many energy drinks do you have a day, man? One or two, depending on how I'm feeling. How many is this? This would be the second. You Under three, man. You didn't have one while you were playing Commander? I did, yeah. This is number two. And then, oh, so that was the same one you had while we, you didn't finish it? Yeah, yeah. Okay. I just got another one. Okay, Michael. I'm on so to you. It's only 600 milligrams of caffeine, man. Each? <laughs> no. No, <laughs> Jesus, no. <laughs> Total. They're 300 each, yes. Okay. This is still a lot. I think they recommend you do... Less than that. Yeah. I think... Let's, I'm going to look it up. What's a recommended... I think it's 500 or less. Amount of caffeine. Up to 400 milligrams appears to be safe for most healthy adults. I don't always drink two. But when I do... Well, I'm tired, I have two. You're going to get the shits if you drink too many bangs. I've never gotten the shit from bangs. <laughs> Yeah, is that right? Sentence. Is that right? <laughs> <laughs> Never got the shit from bangs. Oh, hello, Wally. More like the shit for brains, am I right? Oh, God. I don't think so. How much does Godzilla lands go for? I don't know. Probably not much. We can find out right now. Uh, yeah, you're right. You go on Scryfall, they usually give you a decent price. Is that right? Yeah, they tell you average price on TCG or whatever. Is that right, Michael? Yeah. It's a cool feature. That's a bug, not a feature, Michael. What? Shut up, Michael. I think I need this one for the queue. I don't have this one. Oh, we're miscast? Or are you playing or are you using both? What? You know what miscast does? Miscast? Yeah. It's just better. Really? It's better than Spell Pierce? I think so, yeah. The same thing, but it's 3 instead of 2, I believe. Oh, it's only instant storage for you. Okay. Yeah, this is a non-creature spell. I okay. guess we're a Planeswalker, so Michael. Yeah. Michael, okay. do you even know what a Planeswalker is? Wow, this is amazing. Literal 5 green sources in a deck that has, like... Uh, yes, people have mentioned it. I don't, I don't really know what to do about it at this particular moment, so... Yeah, it's too hard to fix in the middle of the stream. See, I can't imagine why the Echo would only be on his mic and not on my mic. They're the same mics. So, for one to be, like, if, if one mic can hear the sound coming from the other, then it, it, it logically follows that. There should be an Echo on both of our voices, is what I'm saying. <laughs> I 
That was a good turn. I agree. Interesting. Yeah, because like when I see I'm talking, it's barely coming. I think, I mean, I'm, I have new windscreens coming, so I'm going to try each of those. The, the new windscreens these come with are actually not that great. Why don't you just use socks like a filthy commoner? That's a good question. I'll consider it. I'll spend $800 on mics, but then I'll just spend a dollar fifty on some socks. On some socks. This guy's a 4-5 with protect from multicolored. Can't kill it with this. Can't kill it with this. Hmm. I see. Well, doesn't he draw a card if your other guy dies or whatever? No. I don't know what you're saying right now. Doesn't he have some other effect? Who has another effect? The white guy. Yeah, you gotta make a 2-2. Two -two okay. A creature with the counter. You can separate the mics on the right and left channel and see if this. Um... Second turn. Yeah, I like how you got little doggies. So I'm not sure that's actually... It's so fucking loud. I would love another black source. Now do you see the benefits of peace? Right, the like, like high tower digital. Like that, I, 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 that that was my theory as well. But the problem is that like, why isn't my voice traveling to Mike's mic? You know what I mean? Like, I guess because he's kind of facing my direction, I'm not facing his at all. I mean, that's hmm. you play Lanor Elf and sack a forest. You could sack your face. Try that. See if that's any better. I said a thing. Did it make a difference? Do you make a difference? No. <laughs> hmm. I think we can probably keep fight up. A bit of a problem. How come we can't fight planeswalkers? They're too powerful. Hmm. They're smart. Can anyone let me know if they're still an echo or if they're changed it slightly? The thing on the, the mic. Oh, questing beast, huh? Yeah, I'm just gonna take questing beast. Are both mics set to omnidirection or on, on, on der, 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 der. Yeah, those are not those are not options. Yeah, these are both dynamic mics, not condenser mics. What's the difference? Science. <laughs> Damn it. You're not wrong. There is some science involved. Hmm. 
Okay. Yeah, Johnny's actually kind of a pain in the ass right now. They can't really do much, but still. Really love to kill this guy. I really just want to kill this guy, and I don't foresee us having a way to do it right now. I'm pretty sure... I have to kill him in chaos. Yeah. Just kind of do an Hmm. Oh, can I cast this? Yeah, because... Oh, because Pelucranus has a counter on it? Yeah. Oh, that's pretty banging. I guess Voracious Hydrant as well. Probably get Fielder. Um, it doesn't do anything with. Or we could get we have three mana, three different colored lands. We could get um Blast Zone. I don't think it's great, but it's. I think it's the best option. Yeah. We don't need any other colors currently. We're at fifteen. Can that Johnny go up or only down? Oh, Johnny can only go... Well, no, he can go up. You can plus one him to gain three life. Okay. E-boy. You're not being very peaceful, okay? You're actually pretty aggressive, and I don't like it. And he murdered Elspeth. He did? I know that. I don't know nothing about the lore. <laughs> Music melee, I can't tell how I can't tell how, how legit this how legitimately connected to you this is. Okay, actually putting this on four seems really good. Oh, we lose Vraska and they lose Johnny. We lose Pelucranos, they lose Basri's, and they lose this guy. Yeah, do the murder. Do the murder. Do a single murder. <laughs> I'm gonna do a murder. And if you can only kill their stupid five six. Yeah, this guy's really a problem. This is why I'm trying to blast zone over here, bro. I think you do it next turn, right? So what's gonna cost six mana to put this on there, right? We've got to we've got to put three counters, which would be one, two, three, four, five, six. You have the tab to do so that we have here. one, two. We can definitely play this guy. Take me away. Yeah, oh, it was delicious. I'll feel the run. We got one, two, three, four. This will be five, huh? Um, we can attack Golos, or we can attack a Johnny with the goose. We sure can, buddy. I know. 
They're real, but it has nothing to do with me. They're just crazy, crazy coincidence. They're also really expensive. Oh yeah, I would imagine so. They look bougie AF. Wait, isn't that a 12 piece of foil though? No. Oh, they have non foil one? Yeah, because I already have the other two in my cube. I already have the Eternal Witness and the like Bird of Paradise ones and stuff like that. Seek. It is a sickness. You're a sickness. <clears throat> Take me away. Yep, you got it. Well, that guy's alive now. It's alive. Hmm. Just the other guy. Well, n no, I was gonna block with the blue grounds because he's gonna die anyway when we oh, make a. That's a good point. So, how, one, two, three, four, five, six. You can block and also use it to make mana. One, two, three. And I have one, two, three, four, five. No, we can't, we can't do everything, unfortunately. We have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And we need nine. And that's unfortunate. Yeah, we're still going to block. It's still going to die anyway. Let's go to damage. Put X charge counters on blast zone. One, two, three. Wait, maybe, no. Yes? One, two, three, four, five. One. You need nine mana, right? Yeah, we're one mana shy. Because I'd love to kill like this guy, but alas. You got it. How many creatures you got? Four? Four cards? Sounds good. Also, I was the Prime Minister of Jamaica. Man, congratulations. Is there a way to activate Golos? Yeah, we have like 19 different lands. <laughs> we just drew a lot of forest for one. You got it. So I'm going to kill that with Vraska. And then Vraska's going to die. There you go. Oh god, that was loud. That was very loud, yeah. One food, please. One tasty dinner, yes. Oh, Heartless Act. That's that does nothing. That's really sad. Oh, uh, why? Oh, no counters, right? There you mm, go. Sick. So I don't lose any permanence up here, though. Um, Let's blow this up first. Oh, shit. That was so bad. That was so bad. Wait, I don't know why you did that. I will well, because I wanted to get rid of this, so if we killed another guy, they wouldn't get a token. But... Yeah. That's really bad. Wow. Wow, that was terrible. Welcome to Terrible Town, population me. Yeah. Hey, Mike, when Frank calls you a stupid piece of shit, what he really means is I love you. <laughs> No attack and the turn. Wow, that's really bad. They have no cards. So that's pretty okay, I guess. Wow, we definitely should have killed this. It's definitely better for them to have a 2 2 on the board. Holy crap. That's going to cost us the game, I'm pretty sure. So now they just make an 8 8 or something. Wow. And of course you draw a Heartless Act, which is like... Actually useless. Oh, well, it doesn't have any counters on it. I could kill their tutu token. Oh, boy. I 
actually very impressed with the amount of damage Basri's lieutenant did to this has done this game. There's an echo on Mike. Yes, we know. We are well aware. It's gonna be alpha. Okay, just that dude and that dude. <laughs> oh god, it's really obnoxious to know. Oh, they just didn't attack. Sick. How many colors do we have? Black, blue, green, food. So we're like one one color shy here. Yeah. No, there's only one creature in there, and I'd rather just get it back. Four fours aren't really not as much here. That's an interesting draw. We don't have any other basics, unfortunately. Oh, we had three swamps. We don't have basics that are going to help us go los. Oh, gotcha. Yeah, this card is going to be unbeatable. I, I'm fucking kicking myself for not having... Something else. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. This guy costs six. Seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. All right. Well, I don't get to play now because my fucking timed out with it. It's fucking amazing, dude. Fuck this game, dude. What? <laughs> oh my god. I hate the I absolutely hate the rope system in this client. Like there's no reason that, like when you have the timer there's no reason for the rope. Right, like you know you have two timers. I have 1930 and 1946. There should be no reason why there's no rope. That's, yeah. that's ridiculous. If you disconnect sure, but like it's only an 8 8. I guess we can kill it if they don't put a counter in. Like why even What's the point of the other timer? It's so stupid. They just want to apply as much pressure to you as possible when you're in stressful situations. Activate Ovia in response. Play my instant to gain two life to put a counter on him. That's interesting. Huh. That actually seems really good here. Oh, because you can sack the fight guy? Yeah, and then just get the fight guy back. I like it. We could also sacrifice Golos. Yeah. Do it all. Murder him. Uh, submit you. Choose one to put on the battlefield. We got one, two, three, four, five, six. We have like seven mana. So yeah, we'll put this guy on the battlefield. Return this dude to our hand arena. Uh, let's get a nice... Eh, so if I try them, is good. So. Yeah, it's gotta go. Alright, that was a turn. Mm, no. You could just attack with a 1 2. What? If they have a 10 10 and a million guys, we would die. Oh, yeah. Why would I? I'm going to go you one point where you're at 26. Oh, guess I'll die. All I'm pretty sure we might be dead anyway because we made a, we like, we blocked the biggest guys. And we still take. 
At least I didn't see it. No, I didn't see it. There you go, you figured it out. Good job. Yep. Well, he tried. matter one two three four five six seven eight nine fifteen yep we're just fucking dead yes give them all lifelink dude <laughs> we're already dead but sure give them all lifelink But think of the life they gained. See, the problem is because I had no timeouts, I had no idea whether to figure out the plan, whether the plan was better to bring to blood to blood for bones or to just cast Polychronos from the graveyard as a 12-12. It was probably better for this because it's significantly cheaper on mana and we would have had more mana up or four more creatures to block. But because I don't really feel like I'm like pressured into like making a quick decision... That I feel like, well, I, I guess I'll just make the one that seems the best, even if I don't have time to really plan around it. Yeah, the rope thing is fucking stupid. Like, I really don't feel like Magic is a game where you should have a rope. Like, you have, you need time to make really complicated decisions with, like, 40 to 50 pieces or, or you like know. Like, they took the clock away, sure. But, like, if there's a clock, the rope is literally just on completely unnecessary. It does nothing but, like, make you play worse. It's absolutely obnoxious. Absolute obnoxious. You heard me. That's how I was able to repeat you, yes. Exactly. That's a weird thing to proclaim, but okay. Yeah, that was probably the difference in the game right there. It was literally the difference in the game, actually. Yeah, just, just keep the rope for best of one ofs. Take it away for these kind of games. <laughs> the rope is a stupid piece of shit, yeah. Right, exactly. That's what the clock is for. That's why magic is a clock, too, just like chess. You don't need the rope. You don't need two timing systems. It's ridiculous. Yeah, like the chess clock is literally the same system as Magic, both Magic Online and, ironically, MTG Arena already has. So I don't know why the rope is still there. Like, it feels like they just added the rope. It's like, Hearthstone's doing the rope. I think the rope was fine when you didn't have individual chess timers, like individual chess clocks. But once you added that, it's like, what's the point? If I want to go take it... Like, the reason I don't like Arena as much is because if I have to go to the bathroom, I can't do that in a match. I literally have to either concede or assume that I'm going to lose the match. Yep. Great system. It's, it's just like, like you have two timers, and one of them you don't know when it's gonna happen, and there's not an actual timer, it's just a rope, so the actual amount of time you don't know. I don't know, Michael. Just take me away, okay?
Oh, good, a scooty swarm. Scooty, scooty. Let me see that booty. It's dead, though. Oh god. Oh god. I thought I almost hit the wrong thing. That'd be a classic blunder. Mother's a classic blunder. They call her old blunder babe. Blunder babe? That was her superhero name, Michael. It's not very good. It's not very good, is it? Oh good. This guy attacked? Why didn't it? I couldn't. You couldn't see because of the stupid animation. I literally couldn't see it. Why would they attack with this when I have a 3 4? Are you serious? Maybe they know that and they just like scum you have it. What the fuck? Why would you attack with this? Oh, the rope. Look, it's your favorite and mine. I feel like the rope happens pretty fucking quick. Like... It's been like, what, 30 seconds and the rope comes up? Sorry, you forgot to breathe. Here's the rope. No attacks. It feels, it feels like, like part of me, the opponent actually realizes that and just attack because, like, you probably won't see it, so I just get in free damage. No, because all I have to do is wait a second. Like, that seems really obscure. Maybe. Still bullshit. I just have no idea. Like, I couldn't see this creature. And in my in my limited logic, I did not assume that they would attack with their 1-1 one, one lifelinker when I have a 3-4 blocker and they're tapped out. Like, I don't know. Maybe I'm crazy. If only your brain was big enough to realize the play. That's super weird, dude. They smashed attack all quickly because they wanted the animation to be going when it hits you. It looks cool. I do the exact... Oh, that's interesting. And they get, I get, they get rewarded because the animation is literally covering the creatures. I just hope that one life doesn't come down to the game where they're just gonna have to not die or die by one. It actually seems super relevant in this matchup. Oh, that's a banger. Oh yeah, put him on the murder timer. <laughs> oh boy, no attacks, my dude. Now that's a rope. Yeah, you're right. Oh, yeah, you're right. It's also nice because, like, unless you have an instant way to deal with it, you're at least going to get one of their dudes. Take me away. You got it, man. Where you want to go? Oh, you know. So we got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. We have nine mana. We can play this for four. And then what? And then what do we do? Well, you better hurry up quick. Cause the fucking rope's coming for your ass. <laughs> Dude, I hate it so I much, we, man. I don't think we bones yet. One, two, three, four. Then we have... Oh, no, I think we bones. Let me sack the... Sack this thing. No, I want to sack the Hydra. Yeah, so you can replay it. Yeah, sack the Hydra. Sack the Hydra. Fucking rope. <laughs> Wait, we don't have anything else in the graveyard, though. Oh, yeah. Well, we, yeah. No, that's not great. Yeah, let's play Jade. Take me a Jade. Do I just want to keep this? This seems good. Mm -hmm. eh, I don't care. Eh, I don't care about that either. Don't you care about anything? I don't care about anything. He doesn't give a fuck about nothing. I don't attack with the Hydra. That's a 3 4. What? Why would you attack with the Hydra? So it dies, and then we can get it back for value of bones. That's not value, though. But he gets to fight. But I can just grab it without that. Maybe. Like, it's not value. I'll just sack it and grab it by that. Yeah, but then you can get another thing in the yard. So you can sack the... But the only other thing I'm getting is the thing I put in there. Right. It's already on the board. Well, he's dead. Like, I don't have to replay it that way. But you could sacrifice a thing to get it back. It's like, or you could not sacrifice a thing. Yeah, but the what's cooler... Okay. Well, those cards are fucking wild. I'll, yeah, these are. Yeah, these are the two I'm gonna use once they're more readily available. Those look fucking banging. They're like Miami Vice vibes. <laughs> they got necroticus. Oh, it's gone. 
Show me my delivery, please. It's gone. <laughs> Goodbye. Acidic Slime. Oh, a classic. Ooze, a classic. Amemioplasm. Oh, man, that's because we want a deck so I can have that version because that looks fucking bad. The Void Slime. Those are all good cards. Yeah, get that Mimeo, Mike. The problem with Mimeoplasm is it like puts an instant target head. You're like, oh, make a giant guy that's unkillable. It's like, well, now we're all going to murder you. Did you try not dying? Yeah, this is neat. Anything that has cruel reality in it, I think you keep <laughs> in a decent amount of lands. For those watching on YouTube, I apologize for Mike's echo. What if I face this way? If I face the... If I face this way, is there a little bit of echo on Mike's mic or no? I can't tell. Is there an echo for me right now? I don't know. If that's the case, I could sit awkwardly like this and not look at the screen. Yeah, do that. I can watch it from my I'll put a monitor over there. Yeah, that's good. Do yeah, that. Let's buy a whole other monitor for this weird. <laughs> for this weird. That was a good sentence, man. Yeah, thanks. Buying a monitor for this weird. Michael B has a little beard. It's true. Hmm. It's not very big. It gets too curly if I grow it out. Looks weird. I guess I can get a beard straightener. Look at that little guy. A beard straightener? Yeah. A hair straightener, but they. I know what they are, Michael. <laughs> yes, thank you. I guess you could probably use a regular straightener if you do it right. Oh, that's actually Music Manly here. I'll mute mine. Let me know if you still hear it. I'm making the talk now. Do you hear the echo now? What used to say? That should be enough. Yeah, so I'm, I'm assuming that, like, because also when I look over, uh, Mike's levels go up when, or my, my level, the levels on my mic go up when Mike is talking, so. Um, I think we're just going to Hydra for two and kill this guy, and then next turn we can not play Hydra. Dang, dang it. I guess if we draw an untapped land, we can, or Gel Gargaroth is what I meant. Um, are you saying something? Are you talking? It's my boy Machias. If the option is to murder or not murder, you always murder. Wow, that's wild. Oh, good. You're a friend of mine. I lowered the gain on mine just a little bit. Maybe that makes a difference. Yeah, I literally hate that guy. Oh, that was that was what we're looking for here. No text. Take me away. Boo 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 boo. That's a good one. Let's leave you guys this one. One, two, three, four, five. Just cruel him, right? We don't have seven mana, Michael. Dang it. You can't just make up a number of mana and think you have that. We could play Catacomb, Elves, Level Up, like Adapt. Cannot do that either. We have to play Forest to do that. I mean, we should play the catacombs a turn later, right? Oh, we can we can do this because it comes only on tap thanks to the swamp. Yeah, I was wondering what you were talking about. But... You didn't know. I just assumed you were you were right, and I was wrong. Well, I appreciate that. Man, Druid's a banger. <laughs> a good card. You know, it's a good card. Go on. Exactly.
Yep, that guy's getting big. You getting the bubble guts. Don't call it the bubble guts, man. Bubble, bubble guts, guts, man. I'll target you. Yeah, imagine if you accidentally target yourself. Brutal. I'd cry. Hmm. I wonder if we save for cycle. Save for cycle? You might as you want to be a part of my save for cycle campaign? Yeah, it doesn't seem like attacking is good. Well, they're just going to sack a token. Or they're going to wilt this at the end of their turn. Wilt? Yeah, you don't know wilt? Yeah, wilt. So kills an enchantment at instant speed. Or an artifact, Michael. Oh, man, what a banger. And you can cycle it. What does it cost? Two. What color? Purple. Purple? Got him. Strong artifact and shade. It's literally a, a strictly better naturalized. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh, okay. Oh yeah. I'm gonna double block this guy. Does Gurgit off Kurt when you block too? Yes. I'm. Dang. I'm sorry. Can you repeat that sentence? Uh, no, I. I don't know what I said, and I can't help you. Gurgit off when you block. Yeah, man. Totally does. His attack doesn't actually seem that good. What doesn't? His attack. There was no, there was no attack. I was going to say, but he, if he would have, it would have been bad. I think it's recycling. I mean, I would miss the red mana if we hit. What you got, boy? Mm, that's probably worth getting rid of. I don't think Definitely I care about the remorseful cleric. We got reach. Kind of gives them out to the enchantment too. And now we get to just make food forever. You can make food forever. You can make it forever. And now we just play the like. If you can't deal with this, you're eventually just gonna pull your guy. I think time is definitely on our side. Yes, it is. Time, it's on my side. Really? Now you're attacking with that guy, huh? Okay. Six, seven, eight. Also, getting this back as a four, four. Um, let's draw a card. Let's draw a card. Getting this guy back as a four, four from God of Pharaoh's Gift lets you fight something else. That's pretty sweet. Right? I'm not mistaken there, right? Like, when when it enters the battlefield, you get to choose... Yeah, it still gets to fight, yeah, so... Yeah, it would still trigger, yeah. So it would just be a free 4-4 that you get to fight with. Jeez. I hate that this triggers when, oh, like... Oh, you can get rid of our graveyard, though, right? Isn't that what the cleric does? Sure. You're gonna be a hater, Michael. Don't forget to bring a food. I kind of do want to bring a food, actually. Well, we can't. We just played this guy. Oh, little dirt, little dirt burger. This old Dergamus. Maybe you won't, maybe you won't see it. Oh, they'll see it all right. You do have to be a little careful about the life toll. I know, now I feel like it's much worse. Oh, it does, it does force him to, like, sack a flying creature, which is pretty relevant, actually. Right. Actually, yeah. That's a good point. I think it just merges this dude for 7 mana, which isn't the best, but, like... Yeah, here we go. But it also stays on the board, so if we get rid of Racious Hydra, we can bring right. it back and... You got it. Tempted to just play this guy? What do they sack? They sack their 3-3 three, three probably. Yeah, no, I mean... Uh, yeah, we can get a land later. Also, this makes blocking better for us. I mean, if they attack with anything that kills Hydra, we just get a Hydra back, which is pretty right, sweet. Yeah. 
Oh, wow. Oh, they're getting real aggressive. I was not really expecting this attack. What? I mean, I think it's their only option. We're definitely going to win the long game. This seems good. This does not seem good for them. No. Oh, that's a good one. So we just get Voracious Hydra back, and I think we just kill Questing Beast. Yeah, definitely. Probably just Rask to kill the other guy. So they have their force stack the other dude at their turn, right? Yes, 100%. Yeah. I'm pretty sure this and they have one card. Yeah, yeah. okay. Wow. Nice. <laughs> Man, cool reality is a real three? bitch. Yeah. Or maybe? I guess we'll find out. I don't even know, man. Magic's hard. Got him. Oh, a keeper of fables. Yep, 2 1. All right. Not bad. I accept. So the most you can win is three? Yeah. Thank you guys for watching. Slam those like and subscribe buttons. Hopefully I'll get the uh, echo issue worked out by the next time. And uh, we'll let you know how that goes. Thank you guys for the support. Slam those like and subscribe buttons. Be sure to follow or subscribe on Twitch. And I'll see you next time. So weird.